Hi, I'm Ali and welcome to my channel. Today I have the Flavorista Pantry Pack for January 2022 to share with you. I'm still trying to get my tongue around at the fact that we're in another brand new year. 2021 went so fast and here we are already into 2022. So without further ado, let's check this out. Flavorista is an Australian company. They are certified gluten free. They are nut free. They have a range of spice blends and chocolate powders and flavoured olive oils and balsamic vinegars and salts and nut-free dookers and all sorts of tasty, tasty goodies. They do a pantry pack, which means you get a special every single month. This month we have a $25 pantry pack and it's the Greek Art Spice Blend and the after dinner mint chocolate powder it's 25 dollars, so that's a saving of seven you can buy it uh, on my website through the link down below you do pay shipping on top of that but it's still a great saving of seven dollars for those two products and also they have a very special deal for their foodie friends which is a monthly subscription hence the reason why it's made it to my channel it's a monthly subscription for $33 including your shipping and you get two products delivered to your door every month. So this month it is a saving of $9. So this is for the foodie friends and then they also have a competition. If you share recipes that you make with the pantry pack, you go in the drawer to win the following month's pack for free. So let's check them out. It does come in a gorgeous little bag that says beautiful blends inside. Um, and then it says hurry, open quick. So we will do that. And in there we have some recipes and we have our two products. So the recipes this month, they've started doing this the last few, inserting some recipes for you to use with the products. It looks like this month we've got one, two, three, four recipes all made with the Greek out spice. So we have Greek out lamb meatballs, we've got spinach and feta bites, we've got lamb parcels and we've got Greek pie. So. I'm going to go through my pantry and see what I've got in the pantry to make one of these. And what I'll do is I'll insert a picture to show you what I have made. And I'll pop my trusty little glasses on. They have had a repair while I'm waiting for my new ones to arrive. And I'll be able to tell you about the product. So the Greek art spice, this is what it looks like. It is a 100 gram bag. Generally, you get oh, probably 10 to 15 meals out of a packet, depending on how much you use in your recipes. Uh, it says this beautiful blend of rich garlic, mint and lemon flavours is, is perfect for sprinkling on fish, chicken, lamb, veggies and halloumi. Add one tablespoon to one cup of Greek yogurt to serve alongside your favourite Greek at home meal. And I do uh, a dip mix with this one as well. I'm mixing it with sour cream, a little bit of whole egg mayonnaise and some of the spice blend. And it's really nice just as a dipping condiment with either little kebabs or meatballs or even just um, cucumber and sticks of capsicum and things. It's really tasty. So the ingredients are garlic, salt, mint, oregano, onion, black pepper, thyme, lemon peel, fennel seeds, rosemary and marjoram. So that's that one. Then our second one is the sweet one. So we've got one sweet and one savoury this month. It's the after dinner mint chocolate powder. So this one's 250 grams chocolate powder. It is just a little bit heavier, obviously, than the, the spice blend. But they do, as you can see, they're the same size packet. So the chocolate powder, it says this beautiful blend of quality cocoa powder and mint is rich and refreshing. Make your own mint slice at home with two packets of crushed plain chocolate biscuits, a can of condensed milk, a quarter of a cup of after dinner mint chocolate and 125 grams of melted butter. Place all ingredients in a bowl and mix well. Press into a sliced tin and refrigerate to firm cut and serve. Now, I don't have recipes like I do for the Greek out spice. So um, what I might even do is see if I can get hold of some chocky bickies. And if I can, I will make this one to pop up a picture to show you what that looks like. Generally with this one, I mix it with cream or add it to my baking. I've added it to icing. But it is a really nice, refreshing, minty sort of aftertaste as well. And then when it was hot the other day, I actually mixed up a frappe with some almond milk and ice blocks in the Nutribullet, 
added some of the chocolate powder, zipped it all up, and it made a really, really refreshing drink. So the ingredients with this uh, is sugar, icing sugar, cocoa powder, and natural flavour. Um, so that was that one. So that's our two products for this month. So for $25, a saving of seven, you get the Greek out and you get the after dinner mint chocolate powder, one sweet and one savoury. You don't always get um, a sweet and a savoury this way. The packs can have anything from the two ranges, in, from all the ranges in them, any two products. So you can get the dessert sauces, you can get an oil, you can get a balsamic, you can get a tuca, you can get a salt, any, anything. So if you're looking at trying the Flavorista products and not sure where you want to start or what you want to do this is a great way to do it because you get your two products you get some recipe ideas there's also a facebook group where people are posting recipes all the time and it's a really useful way to get to use the products if you haven't used them before or if you're just looking to expand those cookery skills in the kitchen and i'm always available as well if you want any tips tricks you need some recipe ideas i've got libraries full of recipes at home that i can email or send through to you just reach out to me down below and i'll be able to organize that for you so that's what we've got for this month for the month of january 2022 i hope your year has started off to be a great one uh, we are looking not too bad here at the moment um Obviously, everything that's going on in the world right now, we're all a little bit uncertain of what the future may hold, but we've been through this for the last two years and I'm sure that we will be able to deal with anything that comes our way and uh, we will all be okay. So that's it for January for the Flavorista Pantry Pack. If you like that one, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see some more cooking, please let me know. I'm trying to work out what new things to add to my channel this year. I have some new boxes coming and just looking for some different things that I can add. So any suggestions would be gratefully accepted. My only stipulation is that they're boxes that I can get in, that we can get in Australia or it's supporting Australian businesses. Um, it can be a haul maybe. I'm thinking of doing that sort of in the future. A haul or different things that are available to me locally. I'd love to know what you'd like to see. So please pop your suggestions down below or send me a message. You can find me on Facebook and also on uh, Instagram. So if you would like to follow me along, please hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. It really does help my channel to grow and we can start this new year afresh and exploring new things together. So I hope this finds you well and until the next time, take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.